Hallelujah. Praise the mighty name of the Lord. Due to the very first son in the month of April. Today is the second day of April 2023. And I welcome you to morning new prayers today. This is the day that the Lord has made. We shall rejoice and we shall be glad in it. This is our month of green pastures. I declare over you, over your family, all that concerns you, that you will lie down in green pastures. You will be fruitful, you will multiply, you have dominion, you have increase all around. This month shall be a month of rejoicing and celebration for you. I declare over you, over your family, that everywhere that you have been scattered before, God will bring you together. It will be your shepherd. It will establish you in green pastures. You will have more than enough. You have surplus. You will lie down in peace. And great shall be your testimony all throughout this month of April in the mighty name of Jesus. Today is a glorious day. Today is a day of thanksgiving. It's a day of rejoicing. What are we rejoicing for? Because by his grace, it, and as a church, we are celebrating five years of God's goodness, of God's favor, of God's promotion, of God's increase. And even in your own life, there are going to be reasons upon reasons upon reasons for you to celebrate and rejoice even in this month of April in the mighty name of Jesus. So I welcome you this morning to morning your prayers. I declare over your life, over your family, that as you join us in prayers, God will cause you to lie down in green pastures. And so shall it be for you in the mighty name of Jesus. Today is just a day to thank God and to celebrate, to appreciate him for his goodness, for his mercies, for his faithfulness, for his loving kindness, for all that he has done for us as individuals, as families, and of course, as a church. He has kept us, he has defended us, he has provided for us. He has made a way where there was no way. He had opened new doors. He had promoted us. He had given us victory. He had caused our challenges to become stepping stones to our next level. And I'm praying for you in this season, this year, this year of relevance in Christ, you will enter into a new level of relevance in the mighty name of Jesus. All your present challenges shall become stepping stones towards your promotion, towards your blessings, towards your fulfillment, towards your realization of all your dreams and aspirations in the mighty name of Jesus. God will assist you. He will help you. He will elevate you. He will protect you. And great shall be your testimonies in the name of Jesus. Quickly, I'll read about five script verses of scriptures from Ezekiel chapter 34. It's our anchor scripture for the month. Ezekiel 34, I'm going to read from verse 11 down to 14, talking about our theme, Green Pastures. Praise the name of the Lord. The Bible says, For thus says the Lord God, Indeed, I myself will search for my sheep and seek them out. I pray for you today, all throughout this month, everywhere that you appear to be lost, God will by himself search and find you out. And he will bring you to himself. He says, I will search for my sheep and seek them out. As a shepherd seeks out his flock, on the day he is among a scattered sheep. So I will seek out my sheep and deliver them from all the places where they were scattered on a cloudy and dark day. It says, and I will bring them out from the peoples and gather them from the countries. And I will bring them to their own land. It says, I will feed them on the mountains of Israel for the in the valleys and in all the inhabited places of the country. He says, I will feed them in good pasture, and their food shall be on the high mountains of Israel. There they shall lie down in a good food and feed in rich pasture on the mountains of Israel. Hallelujah. I pray for you today that this word of God will come alive in your life, in your situation. Everywhere, everywhere, that it appears that you have been lost. No direction, no, no, no focus. God himself is going to become your shepherd. He will find you out. He will bring you together. He will bring you to a place that he has established for your greatness, for your promotion, for your increase. He will bring you into a place of peace, of prosperity, a place of abundance, a place where your limitations will be low in the name of Jesus. 
you will lie down in places of rest in the mighty name of jesus concerning you your marriage your family your children your spouse your education your siblings your parents concerning everything that has to do with you in your business your career your desires in your studies god will cause you to be in the place of rest it will establish you in the mighty name of jesus you will no longer be someone that appears to be without direction it will be your shepherd it will direct you it will help you in the mighty name of jesus and beyond all challenges you will lie down in great pastures i pray for you today this month it will be a month of abundance for you it will be a month of great testimonies it will be a month where you'll be established in green pastures it will be a month where god will seek you out it will take you from where you are right now in a place of obscurity in a place of limitation in a state of confusion in a state of worries it will put you in a path of greatness such that you will relax you will enjoy you will enjoy divine assistance and divine support in the mighty name of jesus christ i pray for you that every dark and cloudy day that has blocked your vision that has blocked your progress that has blocked your advancement because we are in the month of green pastures god himself will seek you out it will bring you out of that dark and cloudy day and it will place you on the place of glory it will put you upon your mountains of greatness so that your enemies will never be able to reach out to you anymore you will be high and elevated in the mighty name of jesus this is the word of god for you god is placing you on mountains of green pastures where your enemies will not be able to get where they have been disturbing you and frustrating you all those time will come to an end and you will begin to enjoy the peace the rest the favor the blessing the promotion of god in the mighty name of jesus so i pray for you this morning that this word of god will come alive in your life in your situation you will be established in green pastures you will enter into a place of rest god will seek you out and become your own pet shepherd directing you and putting you on the path of greatness every darkness and cloudy place that cause you to derail all of such will be taken away in the name of jesus your vision will be clear your advancement will be speedy your growth will be rapid your increase will be there for all to see in the mighty name of jesus this is your month of special divine attention you will be established in green pastures in the mighty name of jesus christ you will lack nothing good in the name of jesus you will lack nothing good in the name of jesus when we talk about lying down in green pastures i said i will feed them in good pasture in other words your success will be good your promotion will be good everything that has to do with your livelihood your economy will be good in the name of jesus you know god himself is a good master i pray for you the goodness that comes from god they have goodness that god provides it will be your portion in this month and even beyond in the mighty name of jesus it says you'll be on high mountains mountains that, that are close and big and where your success lies that's where you will be god will establish you in greatness good pastures green pastures in the mighty name of jesus beloved when we talk about green pastures we are talking about fruitfulness that mandate of fruitfulness that god had bestowed upon us in genesis chapter 1 verse 20, 26 it will be established in your life you will be fruitful you will have dominion you will multiply in the mighty name of jesus everywhere that you have been limited you have not been producing fruits whether it be in your ministry in your business in your finance concerning your family whatever it may be in your education in your your projects this season god will cause you to be fruitful you will be established in green pastures in the mighty name of jesus so shall it be for you in the mighty name of jesus so this season this month today is a day of celebration and i pray for you that 
everything that you need for your celebration to commence and to remain and to last forever. God himself, the great shepherd, he will establish it, he will bring it to realization, it will come into effect, it will be activated, and your celebration will start in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Today is the day of thanksgiving. I beseech you and I solicit that beyond all your desires, all your wants, I know they are numerous. All of us, we have a very long list of what we are trusting God for. Keep that list in one corner for today. Just go ahead and begin to thank him. Appreciate him. Give him praise. Give him glory. Mention all your challenges that you, that you might ever want, that you are facing you. Just mention them and tell him thank you because I know you have sorted me out. It's a day of rejoicing. And I pray that everything in you, your body, your mind, your, your attention, your, 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 your focus, we all be targeted towards God in an attitude of thanksgiving. As you thank God today, you will see what God will do in your life. He will move you from where you are. He will take you to your high mountains. He's going to be your shepherd. He will direct you. He will provide for you. He will guide you. He will clothe you. It will protect you. It will defend you. And it will establish you in green pastures. And great shall be your testimonies. You will never, ever be stranded again. You will never, ever be mocked again. You will have all that you need for you to be established in your place of relevance. So I say a big congratulations to you because this is your season of enjoyment. So shall it be for you in the name of Jesus. So this day, today, the 2nd of April, I release the blessings of God upon you in the name of God, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. God will bless you indeed. He will cause his face to shine upon you. His mighty hands will be upon you. He will enlarge your territories, and he will keep every form of evil from you in the name of Jesus. He will establish you in green pastures, and great shall be your testimony in the name of Jesus Christ. So shall it be in Jesus' mighty name we pray. The Lord bless you. Shalom.